So in the bathroom here, on the curtain hanger, this curtain here will be installed. It's a little too long and it's been test fitted to see how it looks in place. So this would be the top of it. And along the long edge of whatever the height of the curtain rod is, it's been determined that it has to be cut off thereabouts. Yeah. In this video, I'll show you what works here and how well. So I tried scissors. I found that the layers slip when they are folded, like this, of course. So the layers slip very easily. It's a, it's a slippery type plastic. So, so that didn't work too well. Doesn't matter how many times you try to cut them straight. It's reasonable, but it's nothing like this. So then I tried, of course, knife cutting and that needed two pieces of wood. One, obviously, underneath. And one on top, like so, just about. So, if you take a look at the jagged edges here, if you try to push the knife really hard, it's gonna cut through the first two, three, four, five layers, but on the bottom, there's gonna be one or two layers that are gonna be torn. That's where the jagged edges come from. So what works really well, and of course, make sure the knife is sharp to begin with. And this one has some nicks in the blade there. So might as well remove the jagged edges and start with a knife blade that is sharp and straight. And so what works is a lot of hand pressure on this piece of wood and very light knife pressure on the knife. Just a successive five or six, very, very easy, very, very light passes will make it straight, will cut through all the layers and you will end up with one edge that is straight and is not torn anywhere. Yeah, it's a little shorter than designed or desired, whatever. Close enough is close enough.